Hello everyone, in this video I am going to show you how we will start a Spring MVC project in IntelliJ IDEA. So, from the window I need to go to File New Project. And we are going to select Spring. And we are going to select Spring MVC. And uh, the rest of the things is almost same. Spring test. Then just finish will work. So I know I am creating a Spring MVC project. Okay. So Spring MVC if we are going here we can see what are the things here there is an index JSP page since it is a spring MVC project and we have libraries that include with spring MVC so in this case we are not using maven for dependency we are adding all the jar file into our lib folder so here we have so many beans Spring Web Socket, Spring MVC Portlet, Spring Web MVC, Spring Web, and uh, Spring TX. I don't know what is that. And we have JMS, JDBC, and Core Expression, Context, Beans, AOP. So, logging also there. So, uh, what we will do next? We need to create something. So if I am running this one, I need a I need a server. So actually, how I will do that? So there is a web in INF web XML file. We can change something in web XML file. So here we are going to web XML file. So here it's mentioned like dispatcher so if it is a uh, if, if the URL should be like dot form ending with the dot form it will go to the dispatcher dispatcher is servlet dispatcher servlet so it will handle the request so what I'm going to do is any request I need to move into dispatcher so I'm just making it as a slash so any request to this server will go to there and uh, another thing that you need to do is you need to go to project structure so file project structure and here we need to mention which a Java version we are using so in my case I am using Java 11 but uh, if we are using a Java 1.8 or something we can mention that here the other thing that we need to change is let me look on that Yeah, we need to go to the artifacts and uh, we need to add two artifacts spring 4.36 it's a uh, Okay, I guess we are good right now. So, next step is we need to create a controller. That's a step we are. And we need to change dispatcher server.xml. So, 
uh, if I am going here uh, we can see is any changes that we need so I, I did only one changes for the request I'm moving it to dispatcher dispatcher server so dispatcher server will look for this one right now I didn't define anything here so in future I need to define uh, my beans here so where I need to move and to view also, also I need to mention here so we can see how we will do that all right now we have beans annotation that includes spring mvc spring beans xsd yeah then what else we need here we need to make sure it's annotation driven so for annotation driven do we need anything uh, i guess we are fine right now so So the remaining things we will discuss in our new video. So right now this is just introduction of Spring VC using IntelliJ area. So we just set up our project and in my next video we will see how we will define URLs and how we will run a Spring VC application. I know. Uh, we are just fine with the, the introduction.